Hi all, it's Emily with ESPN Esports, and right now I am joined by Splice Jungler Xerxy. You guys had an interesting game of games. Um, I guess I'll ask you, we've seen a lot slower games coming out of today. What has been behind that, especially since when I talked to you before, we were talking about your mid-game and how you're trying to fix up uh, some weak spots there. Uh, well, it's a nice way to put it. Um... I, I try, I try, you know, I have to, I have to keep it a little bit lighter. Mm -hmm. So, I've, I, I'm not too sure what happened today, because uh, against the game, uh, in the game against Tesseros, for example, like, the early game was, it went pretty good and we were really far ahead, but at some point it felt like we, everyone just stopped trying, or like, something just snapped in our brains and we couldn't communicate, or we didn't know what to do anymore, and then we just got picked one by one by one, and it kept going for like, five, ten minutes, so that's why our mid game looked really really shaky today but i'm sure that if if i mean it's a best of one as well so like i guess those things can happen and i feel like in a best of five we should be able to have uh like we should have a better showing yeah what are you preparing for best of fives versus these single game matches or, or i guess like how are you preparing differently well we have a lot of coaching stuff so uh with lots of people to do scouting report on like what they play, how they play, uh, what their tendencies are. So, like, we are lacking that aspect. And we, as a play as players, we just have to make sure that we have a good champion pool and uh, we just play a good uh, mid-game. That did not happen today. <laughs> now that we're three days in, is there anything about this meta that's really surprised you? Because we've seen a lot of different reads from a lot of different teams, including, like, for example, Detonation Focus Me. I was not expecting the composition that they played. I don't know if you guys were. Uh, so, like, what has surprised you the most about some of the reads that these teams have had on the meta? Mm, don't feel like there was anything surprising. I mean, I think the only surprising thing is uh, is that Echo went uh, all four. Uh, so, um, yeah, that's the only thing. So, as a jungler, why do you think that is? Uh, I would say it's a combination of the players not being experienced enough and not having the knowledge, and both at the same time being the weaker team. Uh, so. I feel like those teams combined just destroyed the champions win rate. And then looking ahead, is there anyone you'd rather face in the best of five? No, I don't really have anyone as a preference. And then what did you learn the most uh, about you and your own team in this group stage? That we can lose to anybody if we don't give all that. Like, if for one second we just turn off our brains, we can lose to anybody. All right, well, thank you so much for joining me. <laughs> um, no, seriously, thank you for your time. And for more League of Legends coverage, keep it here on ESPN Esports.